Welcome to Sheet Leveller. I'm Lee and I'm here to help you understand Excel and its graphical features to make your data presentations attractive. In the past, we've discussed various kinds of graphs, charts and data bars. Today we'll have a closer look at color scales. To use this function, you'll need to first select the data range you want to apply the color scales to. Then go to the Home tab, find Styles and click on Conditional Formatting. Here you'll find a few useful functions that come in handy when you need to present your data in a clear way. We'll go for color scales now. In the window that appears, you can select from two types of color scales. The first one contains a scale of three colors and the other one two. Let's go for the first one, green, yellow, red. Excel will automatically apply a scale in these colors on the selected cells. Red marks the minimum, green the maximum, and yellow the middle values. This allows you to quickly identify which values are closer to the minimum or maximum of the range. We can also edit or remove the color scale. To edit, select any cell containing the data with the color scale formatting, then click on Conditional Formatting and Manage Rules. From here, you can choose to stick with the three color scale or switch to the two color scale. You can also pick specific colors based on what suits you best. If you want to remove the color scale, select Clear Rules in the Conditional Formatting section, then click on Clear Rules from Entire Sheet. And that's it. Check out the other video tutorials by Sheet Leveler to learn more about the possibilities with graphical data representation in Excel. Hit that subscribe button and join us to learn how to use Excel like a boss. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.